five, four, three, eight, eight, seven apple, seven apples, one. Uh, welcome to Peacekeeper. I'm Nathan. That's Hunter. Hunter. A uh, very special episode. We're going to stick around in Finland for this one. So we're going to be checking out a band that's probably next to Nightwish. Probably the my favorite uh, uh, heavy metal band from Finland. It's all in English. Okay. Uh, this is a lyric video, but the, the, the band is called Amorphous. The song is called The Bee. And so the cool thing about Amorphous, and this is something I thought you'd think was cool too, but all their new music, is all their lyrics are based on the Calavella. Which is a 19th century work of epic poetry. Uh, for, it's like Finnish mythology. Mm hmm. You know what I mean? So it tells uh, epic stories and sort of like, I, I don't know, I guess like fairy tales or tales for, you know what I mean? You know, every culture has like the Bible or whatever, you know? So I guess it yeah. has a lot of like their mythology, scripture. like yeah, yeah, scripture, scripture maybe. Yeah. yeah, I'm not sure too much about it. We'll need a Finnish person in the comments to really help us out here. But uh, yeah, it's called the Calavella. So all their songs are about, are taken uh, from the Calavella based on a story or a poem from um this uh this text so it's uh it's pretty cool uh the b i swear i never after i heard this song i never looked at bees the same uh so let's just dive in what do you say i don't know i'm reading this yeah but i've been taught don't trust wikipedia yeah, I've been taught. I've been taught. You know, actually, a lot of the people who manipulate Wikipedia articles are CIA agents. They have a huge operation. That's all they do. So the CIA. Yeah, agents. yeah, yeah. So everyone's a, f a fucking fed, apparently. <laughs> Anyways, Attention. we're not here to talk about my paranoid delusions. Uh, oh, I'm so paranoid. <laughs> oh, my parents are just like, we got spies in the community. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. Do you want to talk about yeah, that? If you do something. If you do something. So hold on. Well, no, we'll, they'll report back to us. Yes. Like, so when when you were a kid, you moved to this small town, yeah. and your dad and your stepmom uh, told you that they have spies in the community. Yeah, they've given me a couple <laughs> trust issues. I love my parents, right? And That's like, I always so... hope to stay in good Dude, graces they, with they them. They sort of turned like, your yeah. They've done. They've done some questionable, like parent decisions. Yeah. Well, all but parents hey, I'm do, the old, man. I'm the well, oldest, dude, dude. so I guess yeah. I was the uh, test. Yeah. The subject, you know. But that's sort of turning kids. your you 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 into like a North Korea. Like you think like people are watching, reporting. You don't know uh, who it could be. I'm anybody. So paranoid. Yeah. And weed doesn't help, or it does help. I don't, I don't know. know. I just like weed. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. But uh, anyways, if you like weed, Hunter, you're, I think you're gonna like this. This is one vocalist doing all this work okay. in this, and uh, <coughs> his name is Tommy Yautzen. He's uh, probably one of the greatest singers uh, working today, or one of them, just because he has such range. But anyways, Hunter, enough of that. Let's dive right into a more. Is the B on Peacekeeper?
<laughs> oh man. And uh, they're t- t- is, what do you think? That's one guy doing the vocals, switching back and forth. Uh, yeah. Oh, hold on a sec. We're going to have... Oh, here, let's have a little pause just because uh, I thought the song was over. <laughs> but it's, it's there's so a bit of laugh. Oh. Yeah. Uh, oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. But, but that's okay. Yeah. Let's have let's, a mid-break. Let's, let's talk Dude, that. yeah. Yeah, yeah. That was so... It's so awesome, this uh, Tommy Yeltsin's vocals, man. I mean, to growl... Is a, is a special skill that certain people do. I mean, you listen to bands like Lorna Shore, uh, Slaughter to Prevail, but then to also have this beautiful, clear voice. You know what I mean? Like, well, when he's singing, like, it's fucking beautiful, you well, know? Just like, um, or like Slipknot, where it's just like... Yeah. It's just like... And just like... Corey Taylor, he has one of the great pipes, too. He's got a great a voice. It's just like... It's like, what? It out the oh yeah the- all you want to do is it that one spit it, it out spit it out spit it out yeah spit it out I spit think. It out. Oh, yeah. I gotta do it. Thank my dad. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right. Or just like, there's yeah. like psych, you know, social, just like, psychosocial. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Psychosocial. Yeah. I don't think you see the preservation of the yeah. modern me. No, so fuck, I mixed up. Yeah, yeah, I, I, I know what you're saying. Yeah, yeah, he he does it also very well. Yeah. Corey Taylor has a great vocals, um, but uh, I I love Slipknot because they really made um, heavy music. Like they made it very popular in North America, and now we have all these bands that are kind of influenced by them, and they're great too. But uh, yeah, all right. So we've got one more uh, minute uh, and a bit. But uh, so there's going to be a breakdown. But man, what do you think of the lyrics? Here we actually will t- we'll talk about it after. Okay. Okay. So let's uh, continue. questions about the association with bees and honey and all that all right so okay so that's interesting so it is like i said taken from the calabella yeah right and so it's about it's ancient poems written by so finnish the, okay, people so it's like you know what metaphors I mean? yeah maybe? yeah but so, like so that's what or i always uh, yeah literal well i think it's uh it's it's sort of like they're i prob i have never read it so i'm just guessing yeah, but i think okay. it's like you know the way that fairy tales are like little stories that teach you a thing you know what I mean? I think yeah. that Calabella has poems and stories that have like a moral because that's how people like first learn morals, like to spread them. Where the, was like a story, yeah, like right? You know what I mean? Time stories, yeah, and all yeah, that shit, and, right? and like yeah. don't do, like don't do this, or the fucking whatever demon will steal you from your bed. Yes, in exactly. Some extreme cases, yeah, yeah. Right? But they'll say like a demon will come get you, but really that's yeah. a story about how there are sickos out there. Oh, man. You know what I mean? Like oh, that's fuck, son. Yeah. yeah, fuck. It could be literal. Yeah, yeah. Like, exactly. When I was a young, young kid. 
Like at the end of my bed, I woke up in the middle of the night, pitch black, and I just yeah. see at the end. I don't see anything at the end of my yeah. bed. I look into the pitch blackness, but all I hear is. <sighs> Shut up! Dude. I'm not even fucking around. I'm not even fucking around. Okay. As a kid, I'm like, Dad, stop, fu stop, not no stop way. fucking around. Stop messing with me. Yeah. yeah. And then it like just stopped. Right, and then like I asked Dad about it like a year later, and he said, "No, I didn't do that. Why would I do that? If oh, I yeah. did that, I would admit to it." I don't right? know, man. I remember you, it's your dad. I think also, he probably could have. I think it's possible. It, well, yeah, he, <laughs> he just forgot. But also, uh, like some like fucking uh, black like demon with green eyes, pit like I I used to sleep in the bunk bed. I yeah. slept on the bomb bunk. The yeah. demon came up from demon. Yeah, the, the, the demon. demon we'll yeah, say. yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. We'll say. Right. <laughs> Let's just get on to the other part because this is somewhat serious, depending on how yeah. much you believe. Um, <laughs> it bobbed its head down. Right, I could just be dreaming this, but basically, 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 yeah. I saw it, and then I just ended up waking up after that, and my mom yeah. had dreams about something like that that was saying that it would steal it from me, and she went to, like, some, like, oracle. <laughs> Your mom? Yeah, so I went to some, like, oracle, and the oracle was like, ah, oh, it's probably gonna be, like, some person with, like, green eyes and black hair. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That, you know, Interesting. Like, uh, uh, like, a lover or something like that. Yeah, yeah. That's gonna take me away from her. Oh no! Is how it's going. Wow, how it was interpreted. But then mm. I told her this story. That, recently. Seems, that sounds a bit like, Freudian, shit. you know. I don't know, but like, yeah. if it's literal in the sense of like, you know, paranormal spirits, I yeah. always. You, Do you believe in ghosts? And well, stuff just like, like that? everybody has that feeling of you know something's chasing you. You know yeah, when yeah. You, you know you gotta get to your bed or you just gotta get to your like one safe spot. The stair demon. Right. right, you know, you got to run up the stairs because someone fucking will grab you. Oh, like I, when I was a kid, I, I, I was terrified of down, everything. I'd hate come down here by myself. Yeah, fuck, or like in the dungeon could, where we film. Yeah, or for yeah. years, I just could not actually stay in my own room by myself because just like yeah, I don't know. Maybe that's just because I shared a room with my siblings for so long. Yeah, so you know, I maybe just felt like safe, but also just uh -huh. like sometimes I'd hear that you know that womp womp. Yeah, and yeah. Like one time, I, I, that, I, yeah. one time, like I had my eyes shut closed and I was crying. I did not want to wake up. Uh, I did not want to open up my eyes because I was afraid of what I'd see. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, like, maybe it's just my imagination, or something like that, or you know, who knows? It's just yeah. fucking. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, maybe, but you could be your best uh, ally and your worst enemy. You know? Yeah, so, that's true. That's true. No, but yeah, true. I mean, if you think about this song though. The lyrics about the bee, like if you think about a bee and the, how they build complex societies mm -hmm. and they build nests and like, well, I don't know if they like that metaphor about building castles in the heads of kings. Mm -hmm. Isn't there something about like oh, them, like, like bees, like, like, bees, like yeah, and done, uh, injecting into the, the queen's head or something like to attract all the worker bees right there's a queen bee i don't you know, know. it's fucking crazy you know, but they have very complex societies yeah, you know what i mean any bee can be a queen bee if they're fed royal jelly or something like that what really yeah, apparently wow we need know. to do see I'm not that a bee because, expert yeah i'm not a know. bee expert or even a c or d expert well, like, while we were talking about <laughs> rogan right there's this uh there's this one chick that uh, came on i didn't actually see the whole episode i just saw a snippet but yeah Someone described her as like a queen bee in human form, and yeah, yeah. Some looks, chicks have she, that. She well, she kind of yeah, looks yeah. like a queen bee in human form. I don't know yeah. how to explain it, right? Wow, Just, but, yeah. interesting. Well, yeah, that was amorphous. But what do you think about it? The tone, the the overall music. What did you did you give th amorphous a thumbs up? Oh, I liked it. Oh, yeah, I really yeah. fucking liked it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You th uh, the vocals are sick, and then they show the picture of them afterwards, and they're like the most badass dudes on top of it. You know yeah. what I mean? Like, uh, they look like fucking wrestlers. Like, that's <laughs> what I noticed about Finnish rock stars is a lot of them are like tough. ripped. They're really they're fucking tough. tough. You know, we have yeah. a lot of pussy singers here in Canada. They're total pussies yeah. in North America. They don't, they don't look yeah, intimidating. Yeah, exactly. Least, right? Like.
like, look at yeah. Tommy Yeltsin. And he looks like he's in the fucking Sons of Anarchy. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah, but he's a fucking really nice dude. He always likes my photos. Whenever I put an Instagram pic of him, uh, he likes them. He likes, so he no, sounds like the, a really nice guy. Well, like, that's the thing. Like, I saw this thing where it was just like, oh, metal artists are full of evil. Yeah, and, yeah. And it just shows, like, a photo of, like, a few metal artists. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know what you're saying. Like, doing, like, regular normal shit, like dancing. Not, not even, like, doing, dancing. Like with the kitty and shit, stuff. they're like, yeah, yeah, the, yeah, just yeah, like, yeah, you know, with like a yeah. kitten, just yeah, like, yeah, just and like uh, hanging out, uh, and just being uh, super cor- chill. Yeah, co- uh, corpse grinder from <laughs> um, Cannibal Corpse. He goes around and he beats those, you know, claw machines for their stuffed animals. He goes to tour and he <laughs> oh, always shit. stops and gets those, and then he All donates right. them to a children's hospital. Oh, and that's shit. sweet. His name's Corpse Grinder. <laughs> 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 you know, yeah, that's so funny. Anyways, that was oh. awesome. We got lots more to check out. Uh, some more finished yeah, shit that I think it. you're gonna really like. So if, uh, if you want to donate to the show, go to patreon.com slash peacekeeper reaction. For Peacekeeper, I'm Nathan. That's Hunter. Play safe. I can put my arm back on. You can't. <laughs>